Hey, what's up, everybody? You are now tuning into the Geeked Up Podcast, your home for entertainment, enlightenment, while adding thought provoking questions with a comedic twist. Join us every Monday and Friday at 10 a.m. for more content and enjoy the show. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> what's going on, everybody? <laughs> Man, we need to play too early, man. Listen, yo, if you were down to it, then you hear these voices, yo. Who lives in the names of the same and cool giving you geek up podcast, you know what I'm saying? Well, you get your, your general news, your sports, your entertainment, your music, all with a comedic oh. twin. All of it, baby. We My got friend, it all. Serenation. Leon, F.A. Millie, my co host. You know what you want to do, man. Go ahead. Get to it. Big Ron Blessing, highly favored, man. Back in action, baby. Man. Glad to be here. Man, y'all already know who it is. It's the fan favorite, GG. We apologize for the serenation, but uh, we gonna roll oh, there. Gotta we gonna roll. We gonna roll. I don't know why you got apologize. The people bless. The people yeah. bless. Yeah. Trust the process. That, that's that's I think I'm, I might need to give them what they've really been waiting for. No, I don't know. Oh, okay. It might. I don't. Before it gets to a sing off, people, it's Q, <laughs> and we're gonna dive right into this episode. Before it gets any deep, we coming at y'all, people, hot and heavy with a banger mm-hmm. of a question immediately. All right, open field, ready? One side of this open field, seven hundred ant eaters. On the uh, other side of the open field, one million ants uh-huh. charging at each other. How, who's winning? Counter question. Where the fuck did you get this question from? Who, what the hell, made you think of seven hundred ant eaters versus ant a million eaters, ants? A million I'm ants, sorry, bro. where the hell did you get that? From? I just gotta know where. The, where did you get that from? <sighs> counter, counter question. Oh, Have you God. practiced Aikido? Aikido? I'm just going. I'm just going to answer the question because he's talking <laughs> okay. foreign. Shout shit. He's talking Shout foreign out to the Aikido now. grandmaster. They know he's talking foreign shit now. All right, feel me. I would. I'm gonna pick them. You ants are strong as shit. First of all, I've seen ants carry picnics. Not relatively. Never physically seen. (laughs) Relatively. I mean, mean, they they say that. They say that. How big are ant eaters? That's a fair question. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking. Like, I don't. I don't know what the. But but remember though, and and this is this is the funny thing about it. They're (laughs) ant eaters. They're specifically designed. To destroy these ants, so but I'm still, I know, I know, I agree. I'm still going (laughs) ants, bro. I gotta go ants, bro. Because listen, even even, hang on, I'm looking up the ant eater average size too. It's 700 of these niggas, right? Even if they all ate a thousand ants. It's still three hundred thousand of them motherfucking ants ready to to, to listen. But while they sitting there full, full and sleeping, them niggas gonna be be chawing down on their throats. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Eating them from the inside. Because I don't know. You know what I'm hey, I don't hang know, on, man. hang on. Before before y'all continue, they can't eat here that you many go. ants. Bro. Before y'all continue, here you go. There they are about. 40 to 48 inches is what it says right here. Yeah, and then yeah. they are also weigh about from 62 at the most 140 pounds. Nah. So so they're not that ants. big. They're they're not they're not they're not huge. They're not that big. But I'm you know taking what I'm ants, man. I don't I don't ants. know. I don't know if seven hundred niggas is taking a million ants. <laughs> 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 the question that I was wondering for real was about like, bro, do you think that they would make like a big ant body wave That's kind of a thinking, thing, bro. or do you think they would like spread out <laughs> so, amongst and then just kind of close in like zombies? Nigga, they would darken the sky, yeah. nigga. There's a million like, ants. Like, like Lee said, bro, like them niggas gotta get full. Like they can't eat that many ants, yeah. You know? Like they gotta get full, yeah. So you think so? That's two for the ants. What you think, Juan? You think the ants as well? I ain't gonna lie, bro. If it's the ants down south, bro, we got like flying ants and shit. I'm having to about flying ants. Flying ants. Flying ants. Fire ants. Fire ants. Nigga, they all types of ants. What the fuck? Ants with wings. No, ants with wings. It's ants with wings. It's ants with wings. Wing, winged ants, fire ants, all types of ants, nigga. Soldiers and workers, nigga. All of them. Bro, I bro, I have not seen no damn wing ants with wings, bro. I, the closest that, thing I've seen to that is a nigga named Ant like passing away in some angel yeah, wings in the bio. Yeah. Like, Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, so let let's tack on an extra three hundred ant eaters. So that's a thousand ant eaters versus a million ants. You what think that you think the ants are still think the ants are still washing them? 
don't yeah, know. Yeah, I don't think. I, think yeah. I, I might still have to give it to the. I don't know. Well, bro. You said seven hundred like more. Million, so. No, 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 three hundred like more. That. So it brings up. You gotta bro. understand, bro. I don't know. Bro, like, listen, like, yeah. at least in my head, bro. You know what I'm saying? The way how I think, you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking all these ants are finna. see. You know what I'm saying? They finna connect to each other and make a big ant. You know what I'm saying? Out of a big that a big ass. They do that like like on some cartoon shit. Mm, You're telling me so, a little vicious. so listen, hey, man. to That's destroy them ants, every ant eater has to eat a thousand ants to destroy them ants, bro. You telling me them niggas ain't getting full off the first five hundred? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I said that's a good I question. They, <laughs> I don't know what their appetite is like, but I agree with you. That seems like an overabundance of ants right there. Oh, I don't think man. they can eat that. Well, oh, never here's mind. The thing. Here's the thing. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Change your mind. I'm taking my man ant eaters. I'm taking my man ant eaters. They eating like that. Them some right. fat ass niggas. Them niggas eating thirty five thousand ants a day, nigga. <laughs> you put a thousand. Them niggas is built to eat ants. One oh. ant eater is eating thirty five thousand. Them niggas hey. destroy ant community, like, bro. Them niggas. Bro, why you, bro, bro, you thought you literally? They said, "What you thought our name was just for show? Wait, what, you <laughs> thought, just for what you thought we just? What you thought this was just a nickname?" It's, Ant nigga. see them niggas and cry like them niggas spell doom for ant li- lineages, nigga. Like them niggas <laughs> they, they destroying them. That, that that's the ant meteor. The, they're oh, the, the ant meteor. <laughs> Bro, an <laughs> ant eater come through. They clearing oh, out a whole region of ants is what yeah, you say. Wipe yeah, out ant they, civilization. They, they oh my gosh. Clans. Clans. What about them flying ants? Don't matter. Well, no, here's the I thing though, know, Jamie. Because I, I've seen, I've seen some shit. Like no, no, nah, nah, I don't know. Because I've seen some it. shit like that before. I don't. I a uh, couple years back, I went on a school trip. You know what I'm saying? I saved up a couple years from freshman year, I think it was, to about junior senior year. Went yeah. overseas, right? It was. This was in uh, you know, Costa Rica, I think it was. Yes, Costa Rica, right? There was a tree. In this forest, we pulled up on a tree from a distance. It was just a big ass, cool looking tree. They were like, "All right, come up to the rope." The trees roped off, just just to let you know that. And they're, they're like, "Okay, so something's up with this tree for it to be fucking roped off." They don't want us to touch it. You get close, bro. I swear to you, you couldn't even see the bark. It was nothing but ants climbing up and down that tree. Like it looked like a normal tree until you get right up on it, and that entire tree was covered of ants. Yeah, it was just covered with ants. Damn. All moving up and down. Like imagine you walk through the forest and just put your hand on the tree, thinking you taking a break for a second, catching your breath, and it's nothing but your whole hand gets covered in ants. Yeah. And then it's just, yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. know, man. Even it with was, the ant eaters was... eating like that, I might still go with the million ants because oh, I think they I might just overpower them. They can't, bro. Bro, these niggas don't have teeth, bro. They only eat ants. Oh like, god. <laughs> Like they, they, they're, they're built. They're oh, built no, they to destroy. Got a, they got, they got this, like a this, long this, ass snout or something. Yeah, they do. They got a little, yeah, they got yeah, a little yeah, skinny. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, literally yeah, they got that the anti ant nigga. Like this is like, <laughs> like yo, I don't yeah, know. Bro, that shit, yo, yeah, that shit. This yeah, is bro, the got, the ants of Superman. This is their doomsday. Is what you're saying? This this is really. Yeah. He they were made to destroy. Ants. Oh, I see now. I see no, now. Bro. Yeah, I gotta change my answer to ant eaters, bro. I didn't know. I was unfamiliar with the game. I'm familiar, bro. <laughs> yeah, no. I guess niggas just took their name for granted, man. You motherfuckers <laughs> big, too. If I saw Ant Eater in real life, I might. I don't know what I'd do. I don't know, man. It's funny because when, like when, when, when you said 140 pounds, I was like, nah, nigga, that's, that's not that small for an animal, bro. That's, I mean. that That's, that's yeah. the heaviest. No, that's the heaviest. That's not average. Oh, that's like, okay. that's as big. That's as big as possible. They got they walking around it. I'm going to say, yeah. They all about 140. It's about bigger than your dog. That's a lot of protein. Yeah. About bigger than your dog. Ain't yeah. That's a big ass little <laughs> nah, animal. Fuck all that. That's a big nah. ass little, yeah, that that's ugly a big, ass that's little a big, animal, that's a, nigga. That's a nice size dog, bro. <laughs> that's a nice size. Uh, 48 inches 140? is like 48, 40, 40 to 48 inches yes. is like three feet, right? That's, that's like three, four feet, right? Something 40 like inches, that? Yeah. 40 inches, so, four feet. Bro, that's. Ass. Yeah, nah. That's yeah. bigger than some niggas. Yeah, that one forty for sure. <laughs> yeah, that, that one forty for sure. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 the way some of these, the way some of these designer shirts be fit, bro, niggas, it's bro. definitely big. That's a couple niggas. These niggas wearing niggas. leggings out here, bro. Niggas wearing hey. leggings. Well, fucking man, eight eaters, y'all got it, man. Y'all hey man, it. it's tough. That's that's a tough one. But all right, we're gonna jump in with another one. Huh? I'm ready, just like this. Ten million cash up front, boom, right there on the table for you. Or 300k yearly for 15 years. 
I want to hear what Lee says first. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> 10 million cash up front. Up front. Or 300K yearly for 15 years. Hmm. Don't, and niggas, niggas, well, I want to hear what Lee here for. Uh, what? Shoot, if you, I, I got an answer. I, I got my answer. Boot locked and ready. I'm locking my answer. Locked and loaded. I'm, 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 I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the ten million up front. That's not even like a. That's interesting. Wait, no, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm tweeting. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, niggas niggas trying to do the math. Niggas, niggas trying to do the math. <laughs> I'm trying to do the math. I'm trying to do the math. Hold on. I wanted two niggas. Not the math. The math is gonna determine. Yeah, I'm gonna do the. I'm gonna do. How old am I? I'll do this nigga divide him by pie. I'll do the three hundred. Nah, I'll do the three hundred. Nah, I'll do the three hundred. I'm about to say three hundred. I'm about to say please don't give him ten mil up front. This nigga trying to do math with that shit. Why hang on? Well, before we continue, why are you taking this? Why are you taking that? Why are you taking that before we continue? Because I think because like I said, it'll take like I said thirty three million, thirty three, uh, thirty three years. How many years was it? Yeah, you're doing years. too much, bro. You're doing too years. much. Oh, no, I'm saying it would take me. It would take me 33 years to get 10 m's with that 300k, right? 10k, 10 m's uh, is done. In 33 years, I'll have made the 10 million back. And if I live past that, that's more money than I would have got with the 10 m's. And I can give that on to somebody or something like that. And with 300k, I'm not my mean. I'm gonna live within my means, right? I'm not like. I can. I'm always going to be expecting a big payday at the each, at the beginning of each year. That like, I'm. I'm like. I don't know. I don't like ten. I'm not going to have much to do with ten M's up front that I couldn't do with three hundred K each year. Bro. So you know, you do know, three hundred K every year for fifteen years is less than ten M's. Oh, for you know fifteen years. Right? Oh, I didn't see the fifteen. Years. I didn't yeah, see the fifteen. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was like yearly for the rest. Yearly for the rest like just like until you die. That's not even been fifteen years. That's not even. That's not even like a. That's not even a. That's not even a question. That's not even half of ten. But I'm saying I didn't see the fifteen years because fifteen years makes it not even like a question. Why would you do that? Yeah, you, oh, you might, you might need to, that. Now you want to recant. Ah, uh, now you want to recant. Nigga, I didn't know okay. the question. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Niggas ain't here to question. Oh, Lord uh, Jesus. Oh, Lord Jesus. Plan. Lord <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> well, all right. Bro. Before before we continue on, so that way it's Ten reiterated from, from the beginning up front again. Here we go, niggas. <laughs> 10 million cash <laughs> up front. Right. Or 300K I mean, right yearly. Now, for 15 years, 15. one to five, <laughs> not 33. <laughs> and my answer to that is give me the 10 M up front. Nigga, That's not even give, a give me the 10 That's M up front. Yeah. The reason I need that 10 M up front and it has nothing to do with my lifestyle. You just hey, actually yeah. don't know when you're gonna die. It's so let me go ahead and get that ASAP. Right. That's what was, that's what oh, right. Your life is a hold better on. question, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not gonna sit here and act like uh when you said 10 M's up front, one and Juan wasn't in the bed talking about something. That's interesting. Nigga, you was about to say 302. You was no, about to say that. Oh, no, I said that's interesting because <laughs> I was thinking about it. He was thinking about it. He was he was following yeah, me. He was following me. He was following what I was saying. He was following what I was saying. He was following what I was saying. I was saying I know for sure I'm picking 10 M's up front because I'm stingy, bro. I don't got no time for no no payment plan i'm not expecting yeah. nothing at the end of the year i don't because i don't want nobody playing my money you know what i'm saying so i don't know what anything can Juan, happen bro i'm gonna just take you could go Juan, you could go you could go from living like you live now right mm -hmm. to spending over three hundred thousand dollars a year nigga versus it but if i have the option to get 300k <laughs> take away the 15 take away the 15 right years now? take away the 15 years in fact, let's just make it even, right? Let's say you get 300k for 33 years, so it's both 10 million dollars. How would you rather receive it up front or yearly? Up front, up front, still up front. You know say up front? Yeah, I don't, 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 don't want to, I'm not expecting nothing at the end of the year, bro. I want my shit right then, bro. I'm, I'm, I, I genuinely I'm impatient, stand with it, bro. I re, you really don't know, like, yeah, you, you genuinely know. don't know. I would be blown if I had like three years of 300k and then died on some shit. Like, I would be I blown because I could have 10 m's. And going crazy. <laughs> I have a good. I have a good friend who won a lump sum of money from a from a. Uh, he blew it. Who, who won a lump sum of money from from a hospital case? He won. Listen, the niggas niggas will blow through money that they get on the spot, bro. Mm -hmm. I I. It's not the That's fact of trusting today. myself with ten million at front. <clears throat> it's the fact of a safety net with the three hundred k because I'm not, I know I'm not going to spend over that. So it's like it. it 
it supplies me each year instead of having 10 million up front and slowly watching that lump sum dwindle away that you're not going to add on to. Or well, you could add on to it depending on how you move. But I'm saying it's going to be dwindling away. As far as with the 300K, you, yeah. you're expecting a re-up. Not really. I mean, I, you, well, the only thing on that how, what yeah. type of lifestyle you got. I was like, going to say that that's, to, that's where I would disagree with it at as well. Yourself and you're not just well, irresponsible. Well, well, like, I'm playing, I'm playing the numbers. Playing the numbers, most people that go from making what on average any of us in here make probably wouldn't know how to manage up ten million dollars if you just gave it to them on the spot. Mm -hmm. I, I agree with you that it would be dwindling, but my whole argument against that would just simply be I'll be dead before it's completely gone. Cause there ain't no way in hell I ain't no way in hell I'm spending ten M's before I'm gone. Yeah. A lot of people have said that and a lot of people have spent ten M's. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah. Dep it depends on how you depends on how you balling for sure. Cause I cause I, I agree. If you go on and buy like a whole ass mansion and whatnot, those you supply you supply yeah. family members, the, the you bills, buy cars, the bills will kill bills, you. Different different locations. Like, bro, people people can spend ten the, the M's. The bills will free. kill you. The bills will kill you. Time. Disregard even the amount of luxury you get of maintaining that luxury yeah. will kill you. Fetty Fetty Wap blew like five times that. In like three years. That's hang, hang on, hang on, hang on. I know now the thing with Fetty Wap though. Now here's the thing, because we did not <laughs> know that story. Now, now I definitely didn't know that story. We can't only reason I can't jack back a pass this thing was talking about buying all his boys' designer jeans. Bruh, he was rolling 20 deep. Bro, he was rolling 20 deep to the mall, but, buying everybody you know designer jeans. That's crazy. And that's what I'm saying. That's for, crazy. for you. For you, 10 M's might be a really good option because I, uh, I know yeah, that that's going to set me off. That's going to set me off. Could, 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 you know what I'm saying, appropriately handle 10 M's. I think it pretty much, I pretty much think, well, I don't know. I don't know about Javen. I don't know. I'm going to fuck that shit up. What do you think? <laughs> he said, oh, I'm going to fuck it up. I'm going to fuck it up. Oh, nigga, I just bought me, average, I just bought me a new oh, toy, dummy. I just bought me a new toy. Average for the average person, for most people, the three hundred k yearly is a much better option <laughs> for a lot of. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I tell you, yeah, the only thing I can see that with that, like you said, three hundred thousand a year is, uh, if you're looking at it from a standpoint where you're like going so deep into the fact that you could think that okay, like the money, the value of this three hundred thousand might be different in this year than it is going to be in this present time right now. So having that three, having that secure 300,000 next year, you know what I'm saying? It might appreciate more value depending on what is, what you're going to buy from it at that time. That's the only way I can see that really. Cause you, for example, you buy a car that's 2020, well, we in 2023, you buy 2023 right now. It's not going to be as much as it was last year that it is the next year. You know what I'm saying? It's going to depreciate. So that's the only way I can see that. You're calculating in fiscal growth or like the, our fiscal changes throughout the years. You're not calculating in yeah. human growth. People grow. You, I, I'd want a buffer to learn how to operate with money. Like I, I've, I've never been rich. I've never been th um, 10 million, 300,000 a year rich. So I, I'd at least like a two year buffer to be like, okay, I, I learned from my mistakes. I did some crazy stuff with this little money I was getting. And then now each year, you know how to move. I'm definitely Man. fucking that shit up. I was just thinking about all this shit I was about to buy. Right? Yeah, you <laughs> gonna be fucking it off, <laughs> nigga. Fucking it off. Like I was like, I was thinking, I was like, yo, I'm probably gonna buy a Chick Fil A for sure. I'm a hip hop chicken for real. Jip, jip, job chicken. You know what I'm saying? Come on, <laughs> 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 yeah, jip, job chicken. Come on, Chick Fil J. This well, shit blew up. We, I'm hitting up. hip hop chicken. The first nigga I'm hitting up for you. We getting a sponsorship, nigga. <laughs> this this hey. episode brought to you by hip hop jip jop jigger. That right there might be a, that right there's a future. Hey. That right there's a Just future. Just for you, man. We might need to get you the hip hop chicken chain, man. That right hey, there, the, the hip hop no, chicken what? chain. No, come on, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not doing that. Just like the KFC, just like the KFC photo that we talked about before, bro. It's gonna be. It's gonna be another Black History Month. <laughs> the hip hop the chicken chain. Go to fucking room. Get get a get a chicken right here, and then the wing behind it, like the flash, look like the flash symbol, like the flash symbol. Get a chicken wing behind it. Yeah, no. job, nigga. You about to say leave? You about to say? I was gonna say. So so answer the question. Uh, I think Juan said ten M's. Quinn said ten M's. What'd you say? Oh me. Take away the <laughs> take away the fifteen years. I'm just saying like. Take away if I take away the fifteen years, then yeah, I, I'll. Oh. Not even, not even like not even limitless because obviously it's a, I think it's an easy choice if you take away like if it's limitless until you die. So I'm just gonna say for 33 years because that would equal 10 million dollars. I'll take 10 million up front because I know I know enough now and and at this point in my life to be able to handle that appropriately. You know what I'm saying? So I'll take the 10 million up front. It also you know really saying? comes down to like you said as well, Lee, how you handle uh 
this abundance in itself and where where your drive really even is at because it depends on really how you want to get down there's some niggas that want the money just to go ahead and not have to work again and there are some niggas that want to go ahead and pour champagne off yachts in dubai at the most expensive hotels with a thousand hookers with like yeah and yeah, crack on ass cheeks yeah, yeah. But, hey i'm definitely not one of them niggas so i'm taking that 10 new. I'm, I'm gonna need that 10 m's because i'm not <laughs> one of them niggas i'm not, I'm not willing to take life for granted to that degree i was about to say that because too. i know there's a lot of people that I, that think like that have thought like me and have received money and and it's done ir- irreparable damage to them like like I, I i'm not gonna overestimate myself to the fact because i don't i don't know what money would do so i want i need, I, I would like the buffer i would say in a sense of like because I, I forgot which one of y'all said it yo but life definitely is not promised so like you know tomorrow's not promised. So I why not take it now? You know what I'm saying, and then do what I need to do to so allocate it to like what. Up, <laughs> <man. laughs> you get ten M's, you know it come with ops. You get ten M's, it come. It come you know with that. That's the fine print. 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 I would definitely have hours after that 10 million. Yes. 300k like, don't come with ops, I'm like, nigga. You know, I, I never, you know, I never liked that nigga for real. I'm not going to lie to you. He definitely, he was always a bitch. I never liked That's him. Crazy, bro. Yeah, that that crazy. That crazy, bro. <laughs> well, hey, man, that right there, just to get a little uh, difference in the mindsets right there, because well, we're going we gonna to work with some much, much, much <laughs> lower numbers in the state yeah. of. Nevada, eighty-five k yearly to be a confidential informant. Do you have the resume appropriate that can get you the job? Would y'all take it? You say eighty-five k. Eighty-five k a year to be a confidential informant. Y'all jacking it? Am I informing? Am I informing on like a drug operation? Tax evasion, like I need to know what, what I'm in. Let, let's say, let's say, let's say, let's say some white collar stuff. Let's say some white collar shit. You know white collar? Oh yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. You you get into the, yeah, the, yeah. the the, the, the uh, you know what I'm saying? The pyramid scheme, niggas. Those right. motherfucking Ponzi a, schemes and shit I'm like that. Yeah. Right now, yeah, you forex niggas is gone. Y'all out of here. I'm sorry. I'm you right now, bro. Eighty. What, what was it? Eighty-four, eighty-five k. That's not 85. enough for me to be telling on no cartel. On, on oh no, 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 no! You playing nobody with your life? life. You playing with your life right now? The thing is, because the thing is, that's an easy no. job. The nigga only gonna hit you up like once a week, once every two weeks. You just yeah. give him a little drop. Eighty-five k for that? Yeah, come on. <laughs> Give me that, nigga. That's an easy job. It's an easy eighty five k. I can still work my job and get eighty five k. That's a lick. Side hustle. You still so this niggas, on white this niggas right? informers, and niggas informers are undercover cops, bro. Like, which because informant, I'm thinking you snitching on somebody close yeah. to you. That's what I'm, I'm thinking. thinking. I'm, well, I'm thinking. <clears throat> I'm thinking of some some criminal shit that you. You yeah, said like yeah, white yeah. collar stuff. Like you just That's you got what? the drop. Like say you like a janitor, right? <laughs> <laughs> that everybody fuck with in like some big ass <laughs> business building. <laughs> so you making you know a fifty k or whatever generous big. You not gonna add eighty five on top of that? Just, just oh, tell yeah. a little bit of info. Yeah, I might, I might. Give a I little mean, bit of you get the drops on some things. Just give the drop on some info. You, that's, a know, nice, that's a nice. That's a nice bonus. That's a nice bonus. Nice bonus. <laughs> Do a little I extra breath so that yeah so that's yeah so so, so all y'all if, white if you collar, see off the white collar if you see your local janitor start put, popping up in a Benz you know what I'm saying this nigga hop out the car with some ice on his neck what we getting into today watch that nigga watch that janitor bro <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nigga nigga man. drop a drop one of those hand uh, hand sized notepads out his back pocket oh shit my fault Sean my fault my fault, my fault, <laughs> my fault <Sean. laughs> oh they need to drop that. <laughs> Niggas in yeah, there having me. They come in there sweeping. Like, what uh, the just doing, throw. Just throw. Ain't nothing playing on your headphones, just throw. Nigga, headphones and they playing shit on them. Oh, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. <laughs> Hell no. He said, huh? What'd you say? He said, we, we, we wasn't talking to you. <laughs> we oh, okay. Wasn't talking to you. My fault. My fault. <laughs> oh, okay, my fault. But if he was. 
But if you <laughs> was, you know, <laughs> you was, you know, uh, <laughs> hang on. I just want to go ahead uh list off a couple of the states also as well. Just to Nevada, eighty five k a month, uh, eight, yearly. Mm-hmm. My bad, not a month, yearly. Connecticut, eighty four k yearly. Minnesota, eighty four k, and then Washington is eighty three. So, oh, so he's, you know what I'm saying? Okay, well, yeah, yeah he's a state with no yeah. crime. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's like crime. I said. I'm you know, okay. I'm like, okay, you know, yeah. you know, some like chills, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Maybe, maybe like city. a okay. gas station attendant outside <laughs> of where they sell drugs at. So you just kind of right, across right. the street being yeah. like, hey, them niggas over hey. there doing that right now. Nigga, I'm you, A5K, free meals every time, every visit. Ooh, yeah, I can do that. Yeah, yeah, time definitely is. Civilian. Yeah, Civilian. Tom, Tom taxes like shit. Uh-huh. Civilian, the million. Man. I, I can, I, no I can only imagine I how much it. that salary would be if you was in Florida. Atlanta. Oh, oh yeah, now nah, that might be that might be witness protection. Hundred thousand in witness protection, bro. That it gotta be. I go what? Nigga, you ain't got no job. What is where you get this car from? Hold on, nigga. When you get this eight on eight grills in your it mouth? Is eight right? on eight grills. <laughs> what the fuck going on? <laughs> this nigga got a bust down AP. You ain't working two days. Coming with all this jewelry right after somebody gets fired <laughs> every <laughs> single time. It's it's so weird. Somebody gets taken, oh, somebody gets no. fired, taken out of here every single time. So this, this nigga got your bow jeans though. What the fuck? Like, come on, <laughs> yeah. This nigga got a robin jeans. I ain't never seen that. Is he white? Is he mopping the floors in Balenciagas? The ones that look like socks? What is happening right now? Ah, oh, fellas, we got a deep question here for you. Okay, we, matter of fact, it's it's just life is full of little contradictions. That's just kind of how life works, and you got to learn to rock with these things. But sometimes, as humans, we just always want things explained. So let's get your guys' takes on this. It says here on this post from Say Cheese, Chris Brown defends himself from backlash over his domestic violence history. And he brings up the fact, and this I'm not going to read the whole post that he said, but he brings up, and I'm just going to summarize it. If y'all still hate me for a mistake I made as a 17-year-old, please kiss my whole entire ass. He's 30. He said, I'm 33 now. Y'all are the same ones that'll tune in every week to see Blueface and his girl beat the hell out of each other. <laughs> and that's okay. And then he goes and brings up the fact, where's the cancel culture for some of these white artists that date underage women, beat their wives, and they're giving out AIDS? Then he goes on to post pictures of Nicolas Cage and oh, a, the whole thing. Okay. Uh, Nicolas Cage, National Emma Trevor. Roberts, Charlie Sheen, <laughs> and uh, the other guys. The oh, not two and off. a half men. Yeah, the, the the fourth guy picture is cut off, but all four of these posts are about uh, domestic violence from all four of these people. He put a he Chris put Brown. A yeah, Chris Brown shit. said, "Bro, I'm tired of y'all getting on me about this Rihanna thing. I'm 33 years old. That happened when I was 17. What about these people?" So I want to yeah. talk. I want to get your guys' stances on the morality and the hypocrisy in pop culture. Who is leading the charge? What is this? Is there an agenda here? Why is this happening? What? Who's picking and choosing? What? What what are your thoughts Listen, on that? I've I've always I've always judged Chris Brown more for being a cokehead <laughs> than what he did with <laughs> than, than beating Rihanna ass. I've always judged him more for being a crackhead. Hey, hey, I've always done it. Hey, because listen, bro, talk about I, it. I, 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 listen, about I, I one hundred percent feel what he's saying. Like I said, and I'm also in the camp that believe Rihanna was beating his ass too. You know what I'm saying? And and people have already she shown was. people people that tune into this shit. They are not wrong. People have already shown that when when it's proven that they're beating on each other, like 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 I said, the blue blue and the but yeah. in the combat, people people joke about it. People don't give a damn. You know what I'm saying? Just because their their shit wasn't aired out like Blues and Kashan doesn't mean that he was getting beat any less. I don't know what they was doing, but I'm not. You know what I'm saying? But he was 17, and like I said, I also do believe that she was also hitting on him. So that's just how I feel about it. But it's definitely some hypocrisy. But that's just the game you play when you're in the center of pop yeah. culture. Like I said, people uh, are gonna yeah. 
People are only going to take the information they have. Like I said, Rihanna, Rihanna is, I'm not going to also you know, play coy and act like Rihanna isn't a different level of superstar oh, than Chris that, Sean that's what Rock. I was, say. I was mm-hmm. like, it's, like it's I said, Rihanna. That's, that's why niggas are still mad. Cause it, I promise you, if it was like, I, I don't even know. The, the, bit, the flow flow from progressive. Like, well, I'm sorry, flow, but I'm, you know what I'm saying? Like, niggas wouldn't, <laughs> niggas. <laughs> Sorry, flow, flow. He it's said it's if it's niggas it's put hands on you, we just gonna <laughs> turn our show. We just gonna turn. Gonna turn. Lie, man, <laughs> Look listen, over the other like, shoulder. I ain't it's saying crazy. Nothing, but yeah, and the, yeah, hypocrisy, <laughs> the hypocrisy of it all is the fact that people only feel this about celebrities, bro. Bro, niggas, niggas is beating on bitches. Bitches is beating on niggas every day. Niggas that y'all know. Niggas that people know. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, bro, and, nigg- and y'all, y'all do all this towards niggas online and don't do it to a nigga you know. You feel me? So, like I said, I don't know, bro. Hey, he just, he just gotta live with the fact that he did that shit. Honestly, I mean, and this is unfortunately, like I said, this is one of those situations. Like Lisa, he was seventeen. Like, yeah, and you know, it's not everybody feels that way. You know what I'm saying? I moved past it. You know what I'm saying? I was, at first, I was like, "Fuck you, nigga." I, not, not Rihanna, not that. You know what I'm saying? But now I'm, you know, I, not Rihanna. I'm, you know. I'm listening to the music again, bro. I mean, listen, undeniably too. Like sometimes we we really gotta stop. Like we gotta separate the the, the person is themselves from like the music and shit like that. You know what I mean? Because a lot of times yeah. I feel like we do that a lot. Um, Blueface and you know that nigga can't rap, bro. That, that's like and, and that's funny because that's literally what they do. Like that's how they're getting this bread is by these altercations that these planned altercations that they have with each other and shit like that. Um, but yeah, I mean. For Chris, bro, like he but, just got to come yeah. to terms with that shit happen. Like, and then unfortunately, some people gonna hate you, some people gonna love you. You gotta get over it, bro. Nah. The only problem niggas got with it is the, is the hypocrisy of it all. Because the simple fact of the matter is, as a nigga, like I said, I, as a nigga who would never, I have, I have, I said, as a nigga with a mother, sisters, I don't believe in putting your hands on women for no reason. Like I said, right. you feel me? But it's just the hypocrisy of it all that makes you that makes me feel some type of way when when dealing yeah. with all this stuff and how people mm-hmm. feel about it. You know what I'm saying? I just you, you as a man, you know when you put a hand on, on a woman that people are you, you know the reaction that's coming with that. You feel me? So yeah. you have to move cognizant of that. I feel like the times though honestly have just changed, especially from when Chris Brown is talking about his Definitely. situation with Rihanna versus now, like things now as far as like how social media plays into it and uh-huh. stuff like that. Like it's so much bigger than it was then. You know what I'm saying? So People want to see that drama. People, you know what I'm saying? They want to see those fights between uh, Blueface and Krishan or whatever, because it's not like we're hearing that nigga name come up because he got a new album coming out or or just anything that's for what he does, which is, I mean, he's an artist. You know what I'm saying? He's a musical artist. That's what he goes by. But, you know what I'm saying? We're not seeing his name or, or his girl's name in, in the media for those reasons. It's for the drama. You know what I'm saying? So I think that's something that Chris is probably just going to have to realize, like, that's just how... Yeah. That's just how 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 the That's culture the is now. Culture, it's, yeah. it's no, there's not they're not canceling things like that. You know, what I'm saying people want to see the the what's they going could. on behind closed doors because yeah. of all these yeah. reality shows that we've had over the years. People love yeah. drama, so I mean that's. When he when he did that world. when he did that back in the day, bro. Back at that time, bro. I, I remember back at the time, bro. Beating women, putting your hands on women was taboo. Even alluding to the, even alluding to that was was, was, that shit was crazy. Wasn't bro. That shit wasn't. It was happening, but was happening, talking about it, it was crazy. It wasn't, yeah, ha- like, it wasn't happening to this stage. It was to this stage, and then yeah. today, and you fast forward to the day, niggas, nigga, you can catch any nigga online talking about equal rights, equal lefts. So, you know what I'm saying? And so that's <laughs> it's just it's just a different time. That is that that is crazy. That is an iconic <laughs> online meme right there. <laughs> Right. Crazy. I think that you do uh, raise a great point earlier, Jay, that I didn't uh, factor into this, honestly. And it really does, for me personally, it explains a lot, damn near, if not the whole thing. And I really, even in comparison to the white artist that he put, uh, named, I really think it's the fact that it's just because it was Rihanna that everybody yeah. really cares this badly. Because if it wasn't, That's if right. there was like a much lesser or even worse no name attached, just Chris Brown's girlfriend, and she was just like some random 25 year old woman at the time, oh my God, that would have, like, that probably would have blown over. But because it's Rihanna, that shit, bro, like he, he attacked. 15 years ago, which is the craziest part now as well. It's, it feels like it, 
man, time flies. Because <laughs> that, that was so big will, back then. But I, I really feel like it's just Rihanna. I will yeah. say, though, that the world definitely was... That was that definitely probably was like one of the cruelest like cold shoulders I've seen the world give to somebody in reference to something like a mistake that they made because I mean like he was not like bro that that should turn him to a downward spiral after that. It was, it was, it was that, fast you know? though. It was like, spiral. Seeing, bro, seeing like, how his coverage went from everywhere to nowhere. You got to think, bro. Like at that time, bro, you can <laughs> arguably say like both of them were like at the top or or at least elevating to the top of their careers. When that bro, I think that speaks happen. to the I you know no I'm matter saying, what you think of his character, bro. I think that speaks to the I greatness of Chris what? Brown because he's still like people still regard him as he one made of the his best way to back do up. It. He made his yeah, way, way back up, way right and that makes me ask down. like if if that if that situation doesn't happen, is Chris Brown like regarded as like Chris Brown in, like is, a goat conversation like, somewhere? Like, like, like is he like where does his I mean, without that, without that, listen, listen, listen hey, that, that might have been comparatively his his uh Dallas I mean, yeah. series word to LeBron that that stopped him from being the GOAT. That that, that might have been that might have been his say, Dallas series. Look, right there. People in the music industry say all the time that it's it's the only thing that they don't like about Chris Brown is the niggas that he hang around nowadays. Mm-hmm. He hang around with a lot of blood niggas. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Me, I'm I mean, kind of crazy doing that crack. I'm kind of like how Javen said. I I'm a I like separated. So for me, Chris Brown is like already up there, on, on like the upper upper echelon as far as like yeah. him and R and B R and B guys like that. So he's already up there for me. I separate, you know, saying what happens as far as like Chris Brown the person versus the artist. So yeah. if we just going based off music accolades shit like that, oh yeah, he's up there, bro. Like he's up there. He's okay. Yeah, I'm yeah, saying yeah, if that, yeah. if that, but I'm saying he would be even greater than like, yeah. like if you separate him now, he would be greater than what he is regarded as now. So oh, for the yeah, fact for that sure. he would have had, he would have had like a five to ten year span there where he wouldn't have been so so shunned and, from and the industry, yeah. where he could have been really going crazy, like and people would have been receiving it how they should have. Yeah. So no, you're right there. Yeah, still to know. this day, if you bring up Chris Brown, you still, depending on who you talk to, yeah. you still get the. It's still like a 50 it, it, It's still like him, yeah, but he beat uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. every single time. Yeah, and and exactly you bring that. him up, depending on who you talk to, <laughs> that's, exactly yeah, that. yeah, it's definitely, he's been excommunicated from quite a few lives based off of that. And understandably mm-hmm. so, because a lot of people really like take that shit very, very seriously and for very realistic reasons because mm-hmm. of things that they've gone through or seen or whatever. Yeah. So they hear somebody mm-hmm. do with something like that and i could agree with y'all um to a degree i don't think that you can but i wish that i you can personally but i don't know i don't think you can separate the person and mm-hmm. the music or their craft or whatever they did because uh you can same similarly and again it would be granted again if, if you add the context of mutual combat this there and the third i don't think that people would just still be regarding LeBron as who he was if let's just say for instance it came out he put hands on his wife like niggas would not just be like bro but but the hoops yeah, bro, but he's nah, the leading scorer yeah, and all like, and he's still bro, that dude bro, bro. people collect, would be in a like, collective oh, eye nah. you can in a yeah. collective eye you can't so personally you personally you personally you can maybe separate the like oh yeah the music nah, and the accolades it. this but realistically you can't separate the two they're all you, you one. Right, he, he's the same guy that whooped her the same yeah, guy yeah. that won all those awards Definitely the same right. guy that's getting all the money can't I ever hear LeBron put hand on Savannah, yo, that, bro. He he would be knocked out of all conversations. Yeah, nah. go, niggas would not be like, oh nah, bro. But but he's still the leading. Score. Niggas would be yeah. like, that's a dumb. We, we go to that context though, but it, it'd be different when like world world you know premier athletes be you know do shit like that then when it because it says like even like walking around being a bigger guy like you're saying you just gotta be docile like i'm not gonna lie people look at you different when you just a, a freak of nature you can't put your hands on a woman as a freak of nature nigga that is, that is true i've been, I've been so walking around in this like like niggas look Listen, <laughs> niggas looking at Tory Lanez and LeBron different, bro. If LeBron be the one. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> 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 I remember when that Tory and Meg was going on. Niggas, niggas pulled up their heights. It was like, of course he pulled a gun. <laughs> what, what did you do? <laughs> <laughs> he had to defend himself. Yes. <laughs> and, and you see, hey, you yo. Yo, no, hold on. I ain't gonna lie to you. Nah, hold on. No, I changed my mind, yo. I'm with Chris. I'm mad too. That nigga went to jail. That nigga went out a drug spiral. And we, now we got niggas mm-hmm. shooting bitches. We got, <laughs> <laughs> we got niggas in 
<laughs> Being bitches on TV, bro. Nah, I'm, I'm probably mad too. Yo, I bro. will His say it's, that that is something I noticed. Just as a aside, just to say this on the side anyway. Uh, oh, the the interest in Tory Lanez overall period, from what I've seen on social media, has died beyond death. Not like it's going back to normal, but I mean like posts about him with like yeah. the continuing like, oh, he's about to get sentenced or. Oh, this happened mm-hmm. to him, or this is going I on. It's getting so, really. no. I see it, but it gets such low engagement. It's insane. Mm-hmm. Like people, it like like the the world is like oh, the culture. I guess I should really say, not the world has moved on from this entirely. Mm-hmm. Just been like, well, <laughs> see you, Tori, and just that's that. And not even to say that they should yeah. or not, or whether they should or shouldn't. But I'm just pointing out a fact. The, the right. people have his, moved uh, on from Did him. he have his his? We don't know. It's supposed to be the end of this month. <laughs> we this don't month. know. It's end of this month. It's supposed to be the end of this month. I saw that. Uh, like I said, it got super low engagement. I'm not yeah. looking to. I update still think it, that's but, fucked up how yeah. they did him. They put him I in before Christmas and waited till now to do his here, and that is kind of crazy. I think that's fucked up. But <laughs> yeah, well, nonetheless, man. Hey, people picking and choosing sides, picking and choosing what's right and wrong. Who's yeah. really to say? Aside from. The people upstairs. Well, we're gonna go ahead and cross this on <clears throat> over into the NBA people. We have All Star <laughs> Weekend that has just actually currently going on. on. Yes, yeah, yeah, not even just we had one day pass, and this day had the three point contest, the dunk, dunk contest. They have the Rising Stars game. Yeah, the celebrity that game. On Friday. Celebrity game. Oh, celebrity and, uh, game as well, and that was yep. Rising Stars and the celebrity was on Friday. So we just want to go briefly over all the All Star stuff. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think of the dunk contest? And for the people watching, we got a reaction for that. You know what I'm saying? Reaction to the dunk contest on the channel. Mm. Be sure to go ahead and check that out. Whether it's out once this is up or it's out after the fact, check it out regardless. It's going to be great content. So what did y'all think of the dunk contest? Uh... Give y'all reviews over that. I mean, shit. I really can run through the whole what a, what I think about the NBA All Star Week quickly. I mean, so far. Go right ahead. Um, yeah. I mean, it's it's. Okay. <laughs> I guess the celebrity game is always interesting to see. Uh, just seeing yes. just just seeing niggas that don't play that sport. You know what I'm saying? Just seeing those out there having sport. fun. Yeah, it's just like I. Right, but um, who was the one football player? The that funniest went crazy? Uh, DK Metcalf DK. was going crazy. Yeah, DK the was funniest going thing crazy. that happened in that celebrity game. That nigga, that nigga Giannis said, "Hey man, oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you're <laughs> 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 like, yeah, like Mark Davis, man." Like, 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 he said, I'm mic'd up, bro. He said, I'm mic'd up, bro. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is funny. I I mean, He's been cool. authentic since he came into the league, bro. He's so I don't know about so funny as shit. <laughs> I didn't really like the fact that it was in Utah. I, don't, I mean, I don't really know shit about Utah. Uh, Come on, yo. Man. Uh, I'm not really like a... I don't know. It just seemed like a boring city, bro. And it, that and then seeing Carl Malone's face, you know, it's like... I don't know. Mm. I, I feel like y'all could have picked anywhere else. Plus, showing, yeah, seeing man. him on the screen for what he's that. done, because that nigga mm. was, if you know, you know. You know I don't know why they did that. Mr. Mr. Underage Tickler. But, um... Yeah, I mean, y'all could have put anybody Stanford. out there besides him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. that nigga back in... Aaron Williams, there. even. I would have liked that. That would have... Yeah. But, I mean, nice. the dunk contest, we just watched it. If y'all haven't seen, you know what I'm saying? We, we got a reaction coming out for that. Um... Uh, overall, it was like a seven. For me. Overall, it's like a seven. When are they? Um, when are they gonna add a, a, a? Listen, when are they gonna listen to the fans? Take a beat from the fans and add this one v one tournament to the All Star weekend. Oh, we get into that. Hold on, hold on, we get into that. Hold on, hold on, we get into that. We get into that. There's a whole, there's a whole thing for that one because that, that, okay. that right there is a whole topic. We, we don't do relevant to that just yet because that's coming okay. out. Man, <laughs> three point contest would have been cool, but my parlay got fucked up by Kevin Herter and uh Tyler. Yeah, and, you know, Lagos was so, clanking, and I've never seen so man, many niggas list. It it the three bad. point contest yeah. wasn't like that. It, it was and bad. Then, and then, yeah. you know, I man, saw Julius Jason Tatum had that pump thing. Oh uh, shit! Did, I ain't gonna lie, yeah, uh, Tyrese, he didn't win. I don't, I, did he win? I don't remember. No, nah, he didn't win. No, he didn't Dame. win. Dame, Dame won. I ain't gonna lie. Then they went kind of crazy that first round. Thirty-one. What was it? I think. I, think it, I yeah, hate his like jump 30. shot, yo. That shit is crazy. So yeah, that, sh- that shot is ugly. God, but he, he did go off in the first round. It was kind of. But it's funny because that's like the perfect jump shot for the the, the three point contest because that nigga do not jump yeah, right at all. Like a, no it's elevation. A real set shot. Yeah, it's, like. it's a little shuffle. Like. <laughs> 
Mm. Yeah, man, I, I agree with you though. It was cool. Uh, also, I think it was cool. Um, I, yeah, I always watch the celebrity game. Um, I just imagine myself being in there, crossing niggas up, oh. dunking on niggas, all this shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, uh, three point contest was tough. Uh, I, I I actually fuck with the fact that Dame won that shit. I felt like he he gotta win something. Cause I know he ain't gonna win nothing in Portland. I ain't so gonna nothing important. He's getting I'm some gonna... accolades out here. I'm some gotta do something. Some accolades. Same, same. I gotta do something. Uh, oh, the Rising Star Challenge. Um, Jose you know, Alvarado. I, I agree. I kind of agreed with. Um, I'm gonna get. You know, I'm gonna get to that in a second here. But I agree with something that KD has said. Now that I've seen. But yeah, the Rising Star Challenge was cool. Always good to see the young guys going out there. You know what I'm saying? Showing what they got and shit like that. Uh, down contest. Shout out to my, you know, shout out to my boy Mac McClung. You know what I'm saying? 76er on two way contract. But you know what I'm saying? He's doing <laughs> two way contract. Thing. Crazy. Doing his thing, man. He, he he brought it back, man. He brought the excitement back to that uh, dunk contest. We'll see if he does it again next year. And um, yeah, we didn't get to the All Star game yet, but um, feel me for prediction. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna go with the storyline, bro. I I feel like feel like I feel like it might be six and zero for Brian, bro. I feel like that might happen. Like it might be six and zero for Brian, mm. um, but one thing that kind of stood out with me that Katie has said, bro, and it's the where are the big names at in the All Star, you know, like contest and you know All Star weekend in general, man. It used to be like a you know like like a certain sacredness. That was a point for it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, that was supposed to be like a yeah, yeah, like yeah. you know. Stars, but now we getting G stars. League niggas in here. I kind of you know, and I like I like the fact that we doing it. You know, I like it because you know they get the niggas you know, is resting. Shit, but, Bro, and that's a that's a problem, yo. Like you know, what I mean, people. Yo, I, Resting. Fact, no, no, the problem is uh, that listen, you know, what I'm saying there's niggas out there that want to see these people. Niggas is not coming for K Kenyon Martin Jr. It, yeah. Like niggas want to see Zion, bro. Uh, like, I agree, bro, but uh, that's just that. Like, listen, we, that's something we have to accept with the shift that has happened in the NBA, bro. That's these niggas isn't be, these niggas bro, not man, playing man. the full seasons no more, playing through injuries no more. You think Kawhi is going out? Kawhi is not fucking with you, uh, niggas. No, Kawhi, no. Yeah, like no. these niggas not these niggas. We're yeah. past. Listen, when y'all gave these like niggas the free range to miss as many games they want to stay healthy and you know do whatever like that. Nigga. You, you, like, you see that. Not, not even just that, bro. You got to think about the time when you saw the stars, like a, maybe like a Clyde Drexler or MJ, niggas like that, like big names in dunk contests and shit like that. Look at the contracts they was getting paid then versus the niggas that's getting paid now. You think niggas, you think they teams actually from the they're getting paid? Risk, they're getting paid. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, so, of like, course, it's of course crazy. they're getting paid like more Jared for less. Well, well, you telling me, yo, you telling me, you telling me, like, I'm sorry, it, it, it might just be the competitor in me, feel me? I'm not saying that these niggas is, is you know, unco- you know, not competitive, but if I know I'm one of the best dunkers, I'm definitely gonna go try to get that title, bro. Like, I'm not gonna sit back and just let niggas say Mac McClung is, is a better dunker than me, and I know I got better dunker, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, I can't you know, do that. You know what? sounds better than hearing be- better like best dunker is franchise player that that's exactly what sounds better than being the oh best my dunker. God. Nigga, you can get both oh my god yeah, that, you, that, you, that's a, niggas yeah. don't care about that niggas trying get to get both y'all. contracts in tech and well shout, just, shout out to Giannis. Well, Giannis be yeah. out there doing all that shit so shout out to anyone anyone the championship shout out to Giannis. So shout out to Giannis, yeah, fuck bro. lebron Fuck LeBron. LeBron done fuck my shot up, bro. I've been waiting to see LeBron in the contest fuck for LeBron, years, bro. bro. That nigga did a whack ass skills challenge. It. Fuck that nigga. You know yo. damn well he should have been in yeah, a dunk man. contest. You know bro. damn well. Aaron yo. Gordon. And, yeah, this is a. Oh, no. Well, yeah, that's a fact. He nigga said with Aaron Gordon. Maybe not that year. <laughs> not, no, I'm not saying, no, I'm saying, like, like, a collect, I'm saying like a collective best dunkers roster. Like, if we would have had Prime Bron, like Cavs Bron in there with like a. first Yeah, first stint LeBron. When he was with the Cavs, that first thing, he should have won that against Vince Carter. Boy, he would have went. Or maybe like the last Miami, yeah, one of those years, bro. He would have went. Y'all niggas are kind of confusing, like, uh, like dunkers. I feel like y'all niggas are kind of confusing. Like, you got like niggas like a power dunker. I feel like Bron is more like a he gonna power muscle his way to to dunk versus like a Vince Carter, where it's like I don't know, it's more creative, more aesthetically pleasing. And shit like that. No, I, I, know mean, you I agree with that. No, I, I agree. I agree I, I with that. Was, well, what I was saying, I, mean, saying, I, I don't think of Well, no one because, like because of his size. I agree with you because of his size. I would think yeah, he was gonna have to do like big man kind of like he'd have to do some like the White House Superman type shit in order to. He's an bro. LeBron is a. He's not getting. That's what he would have had to do. I agree. That's what he would have had to do. That's what he'd be doing. The dunk contest is is an event for athletic niggas. LeBron is the most. 
most athletic nigga. Oh, you're yeah. like, you know what's funny, funny, bro? He yeah, jumped yeah. over a nigga in game. That's, that's what we're saying. Like, that's what we're trying to see. He jumped over a nigga in game. Thank you. Like, I see you. That's what we're trying to see. Now do this shit. I'm just that saying, if y'all trying to put him up against, even if you put him up against Vince Carter, the fuck man. am I looking at Larry Nance I mean, Jr. You understand that? You understand that excitement as a you're fan, right. though? That you would. Get, so you telling me as a fan, you're not gonna be hype. You're not gonna be hype to see Vince Carter, uh, name, Jason man. Richardson, and and like Tracy McGrady and Kobe all in a dunk contest. Like that's what come I'm on saying, now. man. I think that's, seeing the names, but I don't think I'm gonna be pleased with the dunks that he's doing. I don't God, think he's doing no yeah. creative. Oh my God. Like on no Vince Carter. Like uh, you be hating. I just, I don't think he's LeBron hating might, he level, might, bro. He saying, might do the there's double a, windmill. There's a, there's a difference. Bro, that's what I'm LeBron saying, gonna bro. do the double windmill. <laughs> throw the powder, <laughs> he's gonna throw the powder <laughs> in the air. <laughs> this thing go. <laughs> oh, hold on, Lee, Lee, Lee. Now you might be on to something. Dude. Hang on, somebody throw, throw some powder in the air. And then he just jumped through the powder with the top. He jumped through the powder with the top hog double windmill. Leave like a LeBron logo. Of Kiss the LeBron. Yeah, that'd shoe. be hard. That'd be hard. They leave the LeBron, LeBron logo. Crazy, yeah. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. That's definitely hard. Well, it's funny that you. Well, Lee, did you have anything to say about the All Star or did you already? Am I forgetting? Uh, I pretty much. I think I got all my thoughts off. Just okay. like I said, I want to hurry and get to the one v one contest. Right, uh, yeah. You know, that, LeBron. LeBron in the dunk contest would only be second to Demar Derozan in the dunk contest. But you know what I'm saying? We gonna keep going. Second to Demar Derozan. Well, nonetheless, because of exactly Demar was in the dunk. Contest early he group, was, he was. What you said, was because of what y'all said, though, this is actually what leads to this question right here in the of the 1v1 thing. Because with all the stars, the big names are taking themselves out, regardless of if you like the change or not, people are saying, hey, man, resting to help my team succeed later in the season is much more important than winning this damn dunk contest to me. So, that being the case, in order to get with the times, I think that, unfortunately, and I think a lot of people are agreeing, with all the name, bigger names getting dropped off, you got to change the All Star Weekend up. You know, it, it's been the same thing for so long, but it's starting to, you know, what I'm saying the changing of the times. You got to change the events. And one of the things that we've yeah. seen on Twitter, and I want your guys take on All Star Weekend one v one tournament. Yeah, you feel me? We get get those get those straight straight ones. You know what I'm saying? That'd the seven so... type shit, like just just one straight out there, really going. Going I think they the should have been added it, bro. Because I think it would be good now, but imagine <laughs> that back when the league was actually That's like right. competitive when niggas actually didn't fuck with you. Like, like niggas, there was still some pride. Like, niggas would have really been going at it. I feel like nowadays, like, nigga, they two, everybody friends, like, they're going to be on there laughing and shit. I feel like and but it would still be fun to watch. Ways. It would be, it would, I would really enjoy seeing that. So the question for like you guys, what, a Kyrie today, Dame one that, that's why that's like exactly, a, yeah. who, I would have who, who, who would y'all try and see? Who who's the ideal matchup for you? One v one in today's league. Who who's who's the matchup y'all would get the most league. excited for? Today's league. Today's Both league. Excited. There's so many, bro. Like excited. a, a Kawhi well, Braun would make niggas go insane. I will say this. Because damn, I don't want to see Kawhi get seven, bro. I'm they say lie. they say Jalen Green is the best one on one player in the league. So I want oh, I, I want to I want to see that, but I want to see that against Kyrie. I want to I want that. Uh, it got to be, but it got to be that the no misses. That's like the no miss one v one. Like if you miss, you gotta get a ball up. That's that's the type of shit I gotta see with two offensive players like that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's yeah, at the highest like, level, it's got to be – if you you want to you want to win the game, it's got to be buckets. You know what I'm saying? Don't get the rebound, putting it back up. None of that, so you gotta, nope. Yeah, hey, I can understand that. Personally, so all I'm saying – all, all I'm saying, hey, man, run the gauntlet. Dort versus everybody. K put, my, put my boy KD Dort out Dort. there. Mm -hmm. Dort versus Luka. Dort versus Dane. Dort versus Kyrie. Dort. Lou Dort. Okay. He's locking down everybody. All right. Stop it. Bro. Put him through the gauntlet. Please that's all that's that that what I've got right there. Lou Dort. Please yeah, stop man. that shit. I, honestly, I know I kind of fuck with uh I'm gonna fuck nah. with KD and Braun. No, I, I, I was gonna take Braun out. Man. My my actual answer, I, I want to see Jason Tatum versus KD. Uh, that's that that's that's a matchup I that KD. I would like to see. I got KD. That's the matchup I would like to see Jason, right there. Jason don't want that one on one. Man. I got KD. I don't know. I, don't know. I think like I think he do. I think he, he does. does. I, I don't know. No want that. I don't think Jason wants that. I like I to see. KD. There's so many deal like there's a lot, bro. I don't know. Demar it's versus hard. LeBron. In the the LeBron. Man, that, that would be. That would <laughs> I like a. I like a. I like that a. Would be crazy. I like a SGA versus like Ja. You know oh, what I'm saying. Oh. I don't know. 
I see what? Job versus Ant. I see that. Job versus Ant. How about that? Job I mean, versus honest, honestly, can't though, be cool. You, I want to see SG because SGA would get SGA would give niggas a good ass one on one. That nigga got a bag. SGA got a bag. He's like, I would love to see that. Or or do like limitations as far as like um like by position. You think they would yeah. like it that way as far as like just guards? I would think so. I, I, I would, I would or, well, or at least relative to like size. Yeah. Even if it's not like guards so, and forwards so, per so se, it, but like relative. Is it fair to say that? Is it fair to say that like? Bigger guards like Luca, Braun, are they playing with the guards or, or... Luca and SGA would be nice. They play. They, they would play other with... bigger guards. I would say. I, I, would, I, would, say I would say they're probably. yeah, good by height, like you said. Do it by like height. size, relative size. Hey, Giannis size. and AD. <clears throat> I would need to. Giannis, I need Giannis and, AD. and Joel. That's what I need. I need Giannis, Giannis and Joel. I need Joker and Giannis. No, I need Joker and Giannis. No, I need Joker and Joel. That's what I need. Joker and Joel. I do not want to see Joker in the one v one. Niggas not trying to see bro, Joker in a one v one tournament, bro. nigga. You said Jokic getting cooked, right? Yeah. Yeah, Jokic getting cooked. Bro, you don't think Jokic gonna hit him with that whoopsie daisy ass buckets, man? As far as as far as far as like a big, I don't know if there's anybody that's gonna go one with Joel. Straight up, no. Maybe maybe AD. Maybe he AD. Too, he too light though. He too light still. He is too light. Honest, honest AD. They still too light for him. I don't, I don't want to say I want to say Giannis is too light. I like I to see say he's too light. James James and PG. Harden yeah, and PG. Harden, Harden and PG would be I think that'd be fun to watch too. I want to see like I don't know, maybe like Bones Highland. Who else is nice? Oh, this nigga talking about Rosarius, yeah. <laughs> Bones Highland. <laughs> right. oh, yeah. I'm thinking like yeah. dribble, on, bro. Bro. I'm thinking yeah. of some Come shit on. I want to see, bro. I'm thinking of, I'm thinking of niggas. Nigga talking about his 2K bro. team, yo. Stop yeah. it, yo. Stop it. Bones Highland. <laughs> nah, I'm just playing. K- shit, KD versus any other three. Any other Let me wing. see. I don't know, bro. Niggas I'll, tweaking, I'll, bro. If, if Kawhi was down with it, bro, out of all of them, no, Kawhi and Brown, I think we'd have niggas going berserk. See what niggas want. Kawhi and Bron. I think that would be a good match. Well, Bron sure. versus anybody for sure Bron would have anybody. the people. But that that's what would make the tour. That's what like, would make that tournament so yeah. damn fun. Finally, we'd have some people like that'd be bragging rights amongst Lee, yeah. all that type of shit. Like they, they would actually that's something worth competing for. Mm-hmm. Right no, there. I think I think KD would just be unfair. I don't know. I don't I think KD versus anybody would just be like, okay. That's always I'm unfair. Gonna, two it niggas is, that I think it's unfair. Yeah. Two niggas. With who? KD and, and Kyrie, honestly, I think Kyrie. I, I put Kyrie up against anybody. Nick Kyrie honestly. can get beat. Kyrie can get beat. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I don't know, bro. Kyrie I don't know. If I, don't we, know. It, it, I think Kyrie wins if they go by like three Kyrie dribbles. might lose against if Drew. No, nah, if they go three dribbles, yes, who Kyrie gonna win? Drew, the three dribbles. Ooh, oh, Drew yeah, Holiday. Kyrie, Drew Holiday would beat Kyrie. Kyrie the one v one. Yo, stop it, bro. Please, Drew Holiday would beat Kyrie in one v one. Talking madness, oh. yeah. Drew Holiday will be covering one v one. Talking madness. I'd stand on that. I'd stand on that. Nah. Yeah. You can nah. you can call, you can call Drew and he can say it himself. I'm just yeah, he, no. he still won't tell you. Yeah, he ain't gonna tell your ass no. I'm like, why would you do that? <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. What's up, Julius Randall, Ben Simmons? Oh my god. Get the fuck no, here. Ben Simmons, Jared Dudley. Ooh, now that ben Simmons, right, man, right, the topic is fried. The topic is fried, nigga. The topic is fried, niggas. All right, bro. Jared Dudley now, nigga. All right, man. All right. Hey, now. Ben Simmons, Kwame Brown. Oh God. Oh, now we're talking. Spencer you know Dinwiddie, Tyrese Halliburton. <laughs> you know what? Give me Matisse Thybul and Aaron Holiday. I want to see. <laughs> Niggas laughing. Thibble. I was dead serious about Spencer Dinwiddie and Tyrese Halliburton. Niggas is laughing. Look, oh, look. No, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking yeah. defender matchup. Herb Jones, Lou Dort. I was about to say it was some defender shit. Herb, Herb is shit. Herb is. Uh, well, Lou, Lou yeah. Dort be playing that defense. Though. I don't know. Dort my nigga now. Give me, give, me, give, me, uh, give me Alvarado and Chris Paul. I, I want to see them. Niggas. Yeah, no, nah, that, Alvarado. That, that's that's Alvarado, and Chris Paul. Alvarado is give me Zion around that old and, ass and Devin Booker too. <laughs> give me Zion and Devin Booker too. Just oh, for the sake of the rivalry. <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> I, I want to see Ja. I want to see. I would want to see Ja versus anybody though. Ja, <laughs> ja would have to go in the, in the movie. I have to see that. Ja, yeah. Ja and Kyrie would be entertaining. 
I think John, John be, Kyrie would be entertaining. Yeah. I think John, but John, be, John too young. Kyrie, Kyrie be that'd be too, that would be too. Yeah, he Kyrie be too easy for Kyrie. Kyrie would beat him, yeah. but it'd be entertaining. Easy, no, you know, because part of part of it is the entertainment as well. You know, you got you got to keep it entertaining. Yeah, you need some crazy. Now, <laughs> now, Pat Bev versus Kyrie. <laughs> no, Pat no, Bev, no. run the gauntlet on Pat, Pat Bev. Run the Bev on Pat, Pat Bev. Hold run the gauntlet. Yo, run the gauntlet. Yo, on Pat hold, Bev. On. <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, what if know, it was bro. like uh what damn what the fuck was that show? It's so it was on like ABC American Warrior or Ninja American Warrior or uh yeah, fuck, like that. it was a sit <laughs> where it's not it's not an obstacle course, but it's like a gladiator that's for the show, and then you gotta like fight to get past the gladiator to get up to like the top of yeah. the uh thing or whatever. I forget what the show was called exactly. <laughs> but if they mm-hmm. did that in the all-star weekend. League's best five defenders versus the best five offensive players in a one in a one on one tournament. Cool. See if the defenders yeah. can beat the offensive players. Yeah, That'd be hot right there. Yeah. Get, the, be get the best, get the top five first defenders team, out there like versus the hey, the Miles NBA. Bridges. The Miles best Bridges offensive. taking it home. I, hey. that might be I mean, nice. Mikael, Kyrie, Mikael Mikael Bridges, versus Kyrie versus Pat Mikael Bev. Bridges taking it home. Get Dort out ahead. there. Herb Jones out there. Whoever the leading big man defender is. I know it's Rudy. With the defenders, the way they get points is by stops. So they don't yeah. even got. They don't yeah. even got to shoot the ball. Yeah, no, yeah, exactly. Yeah. They just got. They just so, got to strap them up. They just got to strap them up. Every, every strap. Yeah, hold on, hold on I now. Mean, be, I think that'd be a hot little contest that'd right there. Tough. I think that'd, that'd be, be hot. First team all defense versus first team offense. I think hey, that'd man. be hot right there. Y'all, y'all heard it here first. You know what I'm saying? So, oh yeah, the that, geeked up podcast. Y'all see that shit? Yeah, see that shit? We need a dollar. We need a dollar, man. And if we don't, and if we don't, you know what I'm saying? Shaq, Kenny, y'all gonna have to see Rome. And then all the rest of y'all niggas <laughs> up there, y'all gonna have to see one. I'm no, 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 we, no, we got we got the big guns me, out give here. Me Ken, just give me Kenny. Y'all y'all can take the other ones. That nigga got oh, bad knees. Yeah. Kenny the he Jet. Yeah, knees. I'm taking I'm taking Shaq <laughs> and Chuck in the back room and like I said, you know, I'm not gonna have to together out. like coconuts. I'm the only one. Hey man, all right. My last matchup. My last matchup. Listen. This is this is where I would love to see this prime matchup. Zach Levine, Jalen Brown. Tough. Really move me, Zach Levine, Jalen Brown. Really what? That. Nigga said that don't really, really move. Time. What the <laughs> fuck? He's not, not really that interesting for me to it's not watch. Really, I don't know about that. Not oh. Zach Levine missing ass. Fuck no. Kyrie versus Jalen Brown? Hmm? I don't want to see that either. I don't know. I don't want to see Jalen Brown. Yeah, I'm niggas sorry. Niggas don't yeah. want to see Jalen. What happened to him Brown, being? What happened to him being? Right, Ooh. niggas is y'all. Every time I go, I don't know what Jalen. I think Jalen. Hey, bro. Niggas, niggas was talking about niggas. him being the face of the Celtics. Niggas, 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 niggas know I fuck with Jalen Brown, bro. I ain't never switched. That's a team setting, though. That's a team setting, though. That's what I'm saying. We talking about one on one. I just don't see that. I just don't know what that bag looked like. Fair enough. Fair enough. And we got the closeout topic right here. So we're going to close it on the NBA. We're going to use some big names right here. Team A versus Team B. 3v3 to 21. Who do you have winning here? First team, Team A. Kyrie, LeBron, Michael Jordan. Team B, Kobe, Steph, KD. I'll repeat it again. Team A, Kyrie, LeBron, Michael Jordan. Team B, Kobe, Steph, KD, who do y'all have winning in a game to 21? Bro, Kobe, Steph, and KD is giving them me. niggas. That's, that's two for Kobe, that's Steph, straight. and KD. That's, that's two. What you, what you good, Jay? You hear that spacing, nigga? <laughs> like, straight man, wreck. Man. Them niggas not going to know what Come to on, do with that. <laughs> Kobe, on, Steph, man. and KD. I mean, Kyrie did hit that shot in 2016 over Steph, bro. I mean. I, hey, hey, Jay, hey, I'm, I'm with Team A, feel me? I, I'm with I, Team I, A. I think I'm LeBron and a. Mike and Kyrie, I think. I think I think Mike could I think Mike could stop Kobe. I think LeBron could hold his own over over KD. And you I think hold on. Did you yeah. see what what Bron what what KD did to to Bron when they played? Wait, hang on, hang on. I thought hang on. Team setting, team setting. He he gave that nigga buckets back. Saying, bro, what are you talking about? He gave that nigga buckets back. He gave that nigga buckets back. Yeah. Yeah. KD, but it's not happening. He he get what? He yeah. averaged a triple double against KD. Come on, yeah. One. Well, are we talking about a team setting or are we talking Who's about the world? Are we not? First of all, Bron, Bron got that triple double. Bron got that triple double on Iggy and Dre. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that <laughs> was on KD. 
<laughs> that wasn't KD. That wasn't KD. KD was over KD. to KD. KD, KD caught some of that 30 and 13. KD got them buckets, buckets on Bron's head. KD caught some of that 30 and 13. KD got them buckets on Bron's head. You know who KD was guarding, nigga? Maurice Spates, nigga. That nigga wasn't wasting no energy. And that proves our point right there. He didn't that proves that, that he was no saving smoke. energy to get them nah, buckets on Bron's head. He didn't want no smoke Bro, Bron gave him buckets bro. right back. That's the craziest Same. part Bron about it. That's the craziest part. He was part. never on him. Uh-huh. Oh, then Bron, Bron, was Bron guarding KD? I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, was he that? I'm not going to lie to you. I'm sorry. I just don't feel like I don't feel like the most winningness. No, I'm sorry. The the most one of the most competitive, if not the most competitive nigga ever to live in the game of basketball is losing that game. I don't think Michael Jordan is letting them niggas lose. I'm sorry. I just don't think that, that's, that's happening. The, the, the part you, you, about you, it for me, yeah, Jay, that's, why, the that's, why there's a, that's why there's a that's why there's a Kobe that separates. That's why there's a Kobe Bryant. And that's why there's a fucking LeBron James right now. And that's why there's a Kevin Durant, a bad man. And that's why there's a Kyrie, a flat earth. Nigga that don't come into work. There we go, got him. A nigga that don't come into work. So hang on, hang on, nigga. Nigga said Kyrie not showing up the day of the game. There we go, got him. A non dedicated nigga, a nigga not showing up to work. Man, we got stuff. Look, 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 nah, 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 Jay, 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 man, Kyrie, Kyrie gonna be there, he gonna hit that same shot, Kyrie dragging that team, Kyrie dragging that team down, Steph is a, Steph is a, he gonna hit that same shot, right over Steph's noggin, right over, you gave Kobe two of the most selfless superstars to ever exist, and he niggas is crazy. Y'all fighting for the ball too much they, over they there. Kyrie, <laughs> LeBron, and Kyrie, LeBron, and MJ. You niggas don't know who to get a rock to. LeBron, oh, LeBron, LeBron is definitely, yeah, LeBron yeah, is yeah. definitely throwing the rock. Selfless. What? Yeah. LeBron, yeah. Selfless. Yeah. LeBron, yeah. LeBron, yeah. Hey, yeah. Come on, yeah. Come, come on. LeBron, yeah. Yeah. That's what so no, he's not gonna have to take it. LeBron's gonna give it to him. What you talking about? He's gonna be like, so here you go, bro. here you go, MJ. Cook up. Matter of fact, don't know how to move without bringing the ball down the court. So he's doing it this year. He's doing it this year. He off the pick. Quick, he quick, off quick. the pick, bro. He's quick. rolling off the pick. He's rolling quick. off the pick. These niggas don't know, bro. You're he's giving, posting up. You're giving Michael Jordan a better Scottie Pippen, and you're telling me he's not going to win? Better Scotty Pippen. Like better Scotty. Yeah. Better in what? Yes. what? A better point for him. Better in offense. Yes. Better in offense. Okay. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Joe. Is he not the leader? I'm saying only, he's <laughs> better in offense. Come on, yeah. I give him that. Oh, 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 no, I'm not going to say defense. No. Mm-hmm. All right, let's say Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> what what is, about is, to get ignored. ignored. What it was. Like, <laughs> I'm saying, I was, I, was try, I was still trying to figure out who was you comparing to Scotty. He said LeBron, LeBron. is a better Scotty. I mean, LeBron right. is a better Scotty. Okay. That's what he said. Why know that? Yeah, why not goofy like you? That point four shit matter when you got five, not three. Fuck you need all. What the fuck you need a general for? Fuck you need a four generals. Only two niggas out here. Only two other niggas out here. We don't need the direction. Listen, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. Ain't nigga that got chosen one on his back. He just might fucking win that game. Okay? Hey, hey, Javen, Javen, bro. I'm talking. The reason I picked that team, man, bro. I'm thinking about the defensive end, man. I'm thinking about the defensive Jamie. end of the ball, bro. I'm definitely thinking LeBron, LeBron. Hey, dude, bro, LeBron is definitely going bucket uh, for bucket with KD. I, guess, I, I don't guess care Kobe, how. I, I don't care Kobe. how fancy his buckets look. LeBron is definitely getting Kobe just as many buckets as KD. I guess. I guess. Uh, I forgot Kobe. I, uh, I I was pretty sure Kobe was all first team all defense. I, I'm I don't pretty know. sure Michael Jordan won Defensive Player of the Year. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he won Defensive Player of the Year. <laughs> oh, no. I'm pretty I'm sure MJ won Why Defensive Player of the Year. Here's what y'all not understand. the game with it. Here's what y'all not understand. Blocked by James. Blocked by James. Here's what y'all not understand. Here's what y'all not understand. We got one block. We got one block. Here's what y'all not understand. The reason LeBron's not getting off at all is because it's not going to be KD on him. Kobe going to have that nigga in hell and chains. Ball and chains. Kobe gonna have that nigga in ball and chain. <laughs> Y'all niggas tripping. See, you, you talk about think, ball and chain, bro. Lee, 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 you yeah. talk about the mental prison. No, the I'm, shit, my, Kyrie. Gonna be able to do the shit, Mike. Kyrie's gonna be talking to Steph all bro. game. He's gonna bro, be reminding him. He's gonna be reminding him of 2016 all year. He's gonna be gonna be unfazed. Steph is gonna be unfazed. He's gonna be unfazed trying to get trying to catch Kyrie as he's streaking to the hoop. Hey, listen, I'm saying is. All I'm saying yeah, is, he, about. The, nigga, Steph ain't gonna have three screens on him. That's all I'm saying. Hey, hey, Steph, Steph gonna have to get him. off all his own without them moving screens. Without them moving screens. He's gonna need him. He's, he's, gonna need him. he's like, not gonna I've need him. I've never seen Steph pull up. With That's what I'm saying. He's not gonna need him. I'm just saying, he can, he can I just, play I just, off ball and just, on ball. 
I'm just, I'm just I think you're just underestimating the, the amount of greatness on, on Team A over there. I'm I think you're underestimating the amount of greatness on Team B. I'm not. Look, I'm just look, saying. Look, it's look, look, I'm just curious. You what just named two about it, the honestly. top two greatest scorers to score. I also just named oh, two of the top, the the best top shooter, three greatest basketball the best players of all time. Oh, you put two of the best basketball players. Uh, put number uh, one, Kobe. Two. You got you Kobe. Kobe. Same team. You got Kobe, arguably second, third best okay, player okay. all they, time. Score KD, best scorer oh, all man. time. Steph, best shooter all time. Kyrie, best point guard in my Kyrie, opinion. Kyrie, most skilled Kyrie, all time. Kyrie, Kyrie like fourth, fifth on the all time point guard list. This nigga not even. In most fact, skilled, not even. Nigga. Most skilled. He's got top five point guards all time. He, no, but that don't no. matter. Yo. <laughs> what are we talking about? No. Look, look, Kyrie nigga, nigga talk about, that list nigga talk about this. Kyrie's got the biggest bag. But here's the that biggest thing. But before we even continue this here, I want to get the opinions of the people that are watching and listening. I want their thoughts and opinions on this because apparently we can't come to a consensus here, but that's not really the point. The point is <laughs> to make great conversation for you because we love having them ourselves. This was an amazing episode of the Geeked Up Podcast brought to you by the Inside Wolves crew. Follow us on all social media. Go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, share. Because uh, once again, these conversations we're having are not great just for us, but they're great for you because we want to spark great conversations in the world. Shout out to the people who have been tuning in. Shout out to the people that are fresh. What's up? Shout out to Salih. Shout out to Salih. Shout out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we, we out here. We got, we got, we got a beautiful email from one of our viewers. I want to thank them. You know what I'm saying, man? It's really, really heartwarming, really honoring, and really humble as well. As well to know that there are people aside from just friends and family who want to show support that are really just actually peeping in weekly. You know what I'm saying? Tuning into the content. It's stuff like that that keeps people going. It's stuff like that that makes them want to improve. So shout out to you, man, and shout out to the people listening. And we are out. Peace.